everyone! Today we've got a huge package from MGA Entertainment. A special thank you to them for sending this giant gift wrap package out. I do not know what's in here. I know they had a couple things coming out to me, but I really don't have any idea what's inside this specific box. But what I do know is they sent us out an MGA Cares limited edition LOL surprise ball. And I think there's only one little doll in this entire series. She is wearing a face mask. It is PhD BB. And this kind of marks the time that we are having Having right now so I wish all of you safety health and wellness and I hope that you're doing good so in the meantime while we are together we get to share this lol surprise ball from MGA a special thank you to them for bringing attention to what's going on right now and making it a little fun so it looks like we've got seven surprises and it's PhD BB saying stay safe BBs and that's exactly what I want you guys to do. Try to stay home as much as you can and if you absolutely have to go out, definitely do wear your face masks. So here we got the little zip as the heart and we're just gonna get into it. On the inside I see a hot pink ball and the second layer is pink. Here is our little sticker. It's a face mask sticker. I'm guessing we put this on our doll but we won't know until we get to the bottom of the entire ball. And here's this layer, it says MGA Cares. It's our classic ball, way, way back in the beginning, series one, series two balls. And then we came out with the confetti pops. So here is our first little accessory. If you guys remember, PhD BB has little neon pink boots. Next one is her glasses. These are her lab goggle glasses and she's got her little pearl necklace. Here we go. One more right on the outside of the ball is her water bottle. So nothing's changed just yet. Same water bottle. We're gonna crack the ball open and this should be her outfit. Yep, it's her little lab coat. She is working on a cure for the virus. And here is the special custom bag for the MGA Cares doll. Let's get on in. Hello, it's me PhD baby. I just want you guys to know that please take me seriously. I want you to know that uh, you are going to be just fine and everything's gonna be happy and colorful and rainbows in the end. No worries, everything's gonna be just fine. And, and, and you're gonna go to school and you're gonna enjoy it, okay? Okay, now I'm gonna get some clothes in, <laughs> excuse me. So here she is all dressed up and she had a wonderful message for you guys. Yeah, every little thing is gonna be all right. You know, you gotta believe the song. So with our little sticker, we can take this off right over here and use it on our little dolly. PhD BB staying safe. Oh, it's got little hooks to go around her ears too. How cute. Well, not hooks, but you know, it's got a spot to go around her ears. That is so cute. She's got her own little face mask that I put on upside down because the heart's upside down. All right, that's better. And the ball also comes with a sticker for you to put on whatever you want to put it on. MGA Entertainment cares. Yeah, cause we do and I care about you. And for her water surprise, she is a tinkler. Oh no, MGA, why you have to do me like that? I'm a flying twine worker. But all jokes aside, she is a frontline worker. This is MGA Entertainment's way of saying that they care. So one dollar of every sale goes to the MGA Entertainment Cares nonprofit. So we can join the fight against COVID-19 in support of frontline health workers with LOL Surprise. Yeah, I'm supposed to help kiddos understand the importance of health and safety measures during this time um, with my signature face mask accessory and my MGA Kills hot sticker. These retail for $9.99 and she is pretty much sold out everywhere. So I hope you guys get your hands on one of these just as a memory that you were a part of something huge, something big. All right, you guys ready to see what's behind this uh, beautifully wrapped package? Let's see. Oh, did they just send me the Animal Surprise Clubhouse? Oh, they did. Thank you, MGA. I was just checking it out at Amazon.com. 
And lo and behold, it's right behind this package. Oh, look how cool it is. I think this is a part of the LOL Surprise Rewind. I know they've got lots of new dolls. And look, in this one, I think we've got these two little dolls, Girl Pow and I don't know who that is. That's, he's got some pretty cool hair, but we're gonna have to check him out from up close. <gasps> we've got an arcade in here. There's arcade games. Oh, I love the theme, the arcade heroes. I'm sure you guys seen that video. If you haven't, I'll link it in the description box. There's so much going on. We've got a foosball table, very detailed. Okay, enough of me jibber jabbering. We're gonna get into this clubhouse and set this thing up so we can take a better look. When you turn it around, you get to see them. Here they are. Oh, they are so neon, so cool. Gamer girl, gamer boy, definitely one of the cooler dolls that I have seen and they look like color changers. I can see his hairline. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he looks like he's gonna color change. Look how detailed their outfits are, especially the boy. So that was the back that I was looking at. Yep, this is the front. Wow, all right, we've got Tahani on the cover of the box and it fits so many dolls, two exclusive dolls. Fold up and take on the go. Oh, look how cool that looks once it's folded up. You can take this with you anywhere you go. Seven hangout areas, game room, skateboard zone, hammock, patio, movie room, stargazing space, bedroom and kitchen, and there's a whole lot more. Wow, I love the colors already. Just the outside of the clubhouse is amazing to me. I can only imagine what's waiting for us on the inside. So here is the box, separate from the playset, and it says Danger Zone. Swaggy was here. Oh, it used to be MC Swag. Now Swaggy's tagging everywhere. He's got his little crown on there. MC Swag and her family. Whoa, look at all of these bags. Nice biodegradable bags. They're recyclable. Let's get into all of these bags. Take them all out. Oh, something else fell out. What just? Oh, this is hunky chunky. Is it some stairs? Is it the skating ramp? I think it is. It's the skateboard ramp. And of course, we've got a whole bunch of stuff on the side here. NF plus D, what is NF plus D? Can you guys figure it out? We've got Forever XOXO and Swaggy was here. Of course, Swaggy. Here's a really cool card, good vibes only. Of course, good vibes only over here. And uh, let's see, on the other side, we've got like a hot air balloon, some headphones and some angel ears. Oh, what else fell out here? We got a sticker. His name is Glitch. Oh, I think he would get along really well with BR Dude and BR Cutie. Glitch, high score more than you. Oh, he's sassy. He is so cute. Okay, so I'm liking Glitch already. Let's check out what else is in here. What other accessories we have. We have a tiny little hammer. Oh, like LOL size hammer. And what's in here? Oh, uh, are these his VR glasses? Look how cool that is. It's all glitched out. Another piece of furniture. It's the little arcade game, new high score. Oh, and it has a hologram screen. It changes when you move it. That is so cool. What about in here? Another chunky piece of furniture. This, oh, look, we've got the arcade heroes on here. Is this another arcade game? Yeah, it is, neat. It's a pinball game. I really like the color theme that they used with this whole set, bright. And I think uh, the new Rewind dolls, all of them, they're bright and neon. I haven't seen any of them in person, but here we have a hammock with the same bright color theme. It looks like piano keys on there. And what about here? Someone else loves bubble tea as much as I do, and it looks like it's taro flavor too. It's one of my favorite flavors. Here we go, we've got a, oh, it's, it's for stargazing. It's a telescope, and tiny, tiny. What is this one? It's a game control, perfect. It's so detailed. We need more controllers. We have another tiny, almost non-existent thing in this giant bag. We got some pliers. And more and more, there's lots more where that came from. Here is someone's beanie, it's girl powers. And some more accessories. 
Oh, it's a cute little toolbox for our tools and it actually opens up. Perfect. We can put our pliers in here and our hammer. I wonder who is our handyman or handy gal. I think Candy Baby would love this little tool set. Okay, another chunky piece. Is it a stool, a chair, or at least a chair? Pretty neat looking chair. It's made out of a tire, what? Okay, that must have been our little handy LOL making stuff out of other stuff, recycling. And what about in here? Is this a drum set or another chair made out of a tire? It's another chair made out of another tire, but this one's orange. Here is another chair, yep, another chair. It looks like it's like a, used to be a part of a car. Maybe a sports car? And here is a really neat looking table. What about, oh, here's a little bean chair. It's an actual bean chair. And a skateboard for one of our dolls. What does it say on the end? Land on your feet. That's the goal. That's what you should be doing. And some gas. We always need some gas. Gasoline box. Someone's a soda pop. You're gonna need soda pop when you are working on stuff in your little garage. And one tiny little accessory in here popped out. Here is another piece, it's a wrench. This can go in our toolbox. We're just adding on the tools, aren't we? So three piece toolbox. Here they are, let me take them both out. So they must be brother and sister. And here they are. They look so cool. She's got roller skates on. So here is the clubhouse out of the box. There is four ways to set up. So one, you can set it up just like it is, like that. Two, you can set it up this way. Three, you can shift this side to side. And four is this way. You can twist it to turn it around. So over here up top, we can put the hammock and these parts showing on out. Ooh, it's got little flowers and pretty artwork on there. So yeah, that goes right there like that. And then we can set up our little hammock up here. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Just like that, we've got a hammock. So they're saying we can move, oh, oh, we can move it by sliding it over like that. Whoa, that is cool. You can slide it all the way out. And of course, this side needs a little bit of support because it's kind of looking like it's drooping down here. And that is where you have your ramp come in. You can put that right over there and it clicks into place and it gives it some nice support. Now you can also twist it this way if you want. There you go. You can twist it to where you can have the playhouse positioned this way and you can have easy access to the door over here to the maybe garage. I think this is the garage area. Let's go this way. There's so many parts that you can play around with. Okay, so the garage door opens this way. Let's just position it this way so it's easier for us to check out the rest of this. And you slide the doors open and you've got a really cool workspace. Same with up here, the play area. You slide the doors open and there's more bags, of course. More surprises, a little surprise. What is in here? Let's take a look at it. They feel pretty big. So I'm guessing some furniture. Oh, here's a ramp for our skateboarders. Just maybe have it out here like that. Let's check this next bag. Once we have everything out, then we can put our stuff together. We've got a bed. Oh, nice. And a headboard. The headboard connects at the top. Here's our cool looking pillow and our pixelated blanket. Let's take a look at this room. Look how nicely it's decorated. UFO flying saucer, baby Tron. So I think it's safe to say that our bed goes right over here. We've got a projector on this one side. So I'd say the bed can kind of go over here on the side. So our dolls can have a nice view of the projector. The chair can also go over here. Here. Let's actually do that. Let's put the bean bag over here. And the bed can actually also go over here because this is a bedroom. We've got trophies and everything on the walls. Little dolls. Are those the arcade heroes? We've got the arcade heroes on the wall on a stand plus some nail polish. So this must be our girl's room. Let's move the bed over here just like on the box. Let's see if there's any more decorative pieces in this huge bag. Is this our foosball table? We've got a little tiny ball too. We can actually play foosball, can we? We can. We can actually play foosball. 
baseball. So this card, I thought was a card. It's not. It's actually a part of the play set. We're going to take this piece and put it right over here. And that'll help hold the card and serve as a backdrop. So we could either do it this way, just like with our LOL houses. That is so pretty. I love the way that looks. It's just the brightest, happiest, coolest place that ever. I'm a fan of bright colors, if you guys haven't guessed that yet. I love bright neon colors, full of color, and I kind of like this graffiti vibe they have here. So over here is where our ladder goes. It connects to the two levels, so our dollies can kind of, you know, make good use of our clubhouse levels. And oh, we don't want to forget, let's accessorize and decorate as we go. This is the part where our dollies can go stargazing. So we're gonna need the telescope up here for stargazing. I think this backdrop is more suiting. Look at that, doesn't that look like stars? Colorful stars. Oh, I just realized on the inside of this Danger Zone box, we had a card for Switch BB too. So we've got Glitch and Switch BB. Her high score is Girl Power. So once we've got our playset twisted to the side here, we have more space to store or accessorize any of our other stuff. And let me just do what the box shows us. Oh yeah, right over here, I'm gonna show you guys something because there was some issue with the glampers. I want you guys to know, if you guys end up getting this yourselves, do not stick your fingers in this part because I don't want any of you getting hurt. So now we can add this little chair piece over here so our dolls can hang out right up top the garage area. The cool thing is you can detach and reattach the top and bottom levels. Now let's go on over to the bottom level. This is like the gameplay area. Yep, it says game zone. I thought this is the garage area. It kind of looks like they converted a garage into a game zone area. Since it's the game zone area, we can put our arcade game right over here. Our arcade heroes is a little bit on the bigger side for this playset, but we can always decorate it on the outside if you guys wanna include the arcade heroes arcade game sets. We can also put our foosball table somewhere over here. Here's some pinball for our pinball lovers. Our funky looking little table can go right over here and so can our chairs. We can stuff them right over here on the sides. Hey, even our tools can go right over here. I think Can Do Baby can use this spot as a workstation for her new creation. Make some more chairs. Let's have the bubble tea waiting right here for our LOLs. Oh yeah, and right in the room, we can put our game controller. I can go right through the window. Oh, I love this. I would love to go stargazing. It's perfect for me, the perfect clubhouse. If you look real close at night, you can see Venus. It looks like a star, but it's not, and it's kind of yellow. True facts. Try it. Wow, cool. Another gamer girl. Wow, I love your suit, man. Thanks, dudes. Let's play some game. Watch this, watch this game on. But first, I gotta do my water supplies. Right, let's check out their water surprise. They're not color changers, unfortunately, but Glitch and Switch Baby are spitters. There you go, both spitters. So what do you guys think of the brand new LOL Surprise Clubhouse? Pretty cool, right, right? I think it's pretty awesome, neon and colorful, and I love the gaming vibe they have, along with the Arcade Heroes and the MGA Cares doll. I think we are in for some very special surprises from MGA. Click the thumbs up button if you guys enjoyed the video, subscribe if you haven't already, and until next time, I will see you later. Bye for now.